<clears throat> I'm glad you sat down, thought I was going to have to do this alone again. <laughs> Good morning, party people. Welcome to the breakdown. Oh, Johnny, this is Nate. Uh, yes, as you've seen by my bad pun, we are doing Asking Alexandria alone again. Give me your thoughts on this band of recent, of late, their last few things. <laughs> I didn't really listen to the whole last album. The album before that, which had like Alone in the Room and The Fire and stuff, I really liked. Yep. I thought it had moments that I hated, which yes. is that one rappy weird song. What the fuck? <laughs> but I overall really like this band. I think that the lead singer has a huge voice. One of the biggest voices in rock metal. Yeah. His range is phenomenal. Yeah, look. Yeah. Danny is an absolutely insanely beast vocalist. He's such a good vocalist. But And, and Ben, as a backing vocalist, is also phenomenal. Yeah, and songwriter. Great. I'm, I'm the same, though. I didn't like the last album, really, at all. Well, I found it's it, not even like I just didn't listen to it. I found it very forgettable. Yeah. I listened to it. I found it very, very forgettable. Maybe it I was, did listen to it. <laughs> probably did yeah the one before I'm the same I really liked a couple of the songs can I be totally honest with you I only love one of their albums I only oh. love one of their albums Death to Destiny really yep See, and I like the Skid Row covers they did and I just wish they went for a bit more of that 80s sort of metal sound because they do it so fucking well and his voice is perfect for it but I, I don't think that's a big I really album. liked their first four albums I did not like their first stuff I haven't even gone back and really given it much of a chance if I'm being totally honest. I reckon if you were back and listen to it now, you'd like it. I genuinely think you would listen to it and like it. It has an era-appropriate sound, Yeah, but I, it holds up so well. I think one of the things I didn't like was just all the the talk about them and stuff, and they were very, very seen and very sort of... They were arrogant too. Yeah. I didn't really... This is coming from the most arrogant person on this channel. <laughs> Anyway, please like, please subscribe, check out our merchandise, which neither of us are wearing. Oh, it's because we ran out because it's so good we sold so much of it. <laughs> Three, two, one. Better noise music. Oh, yeah. Metallica wants their riff back. <laughs> That's not what I was going to say. <laughs> this is a lyric video. We didn't say that. This is not the official video. This is the li official lyric video. Mm. Just so you guys know. Oh, shit. Now, I don't want to get my own hopes up. But I'm hearing a, an acoustic intro, and I'm hearing some like sweet metal sounding uh, slow build coming in. They have done stuff throughout the last couple of years that has had that like Motley Crue influence sound. <sighs> Don't let me down, boys. Don't get my hopes up. Don't crush my dreams. Just don't do anything. Sorry, but you know what they're all going to be, don't you? I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> but you know, I had, okay, full disclosure, I had, um, what well, was going to have, atmospheric guitar introduction, sweet lead, um, epic classical sounds, and then I was going to put the bottom one, I'm an idiot, because McGee does all that. But they're all going to be, I'm an idiot, so <laughs> whatever. Great, I can pause that really quickly. Oh, come on, man. No, I'm because... Tense. I'm ready to pop. Starting with a chorus, a gang vocal is so good. Yeah, 
his voice sounds great. Everything right now is building for greatness. If this is going to turn into some stadium rock extravaganza, I'm... Extravaganza. Yeah. <laughs> chorus note and he gave it to me i got laughing at that here's the problem i do this with you so often yeah that whenever at the corner of my eye, i see you doing something now i think of something funny that i would put in the video uh. like when you're there going <laughs> i'm imagining little versions of your head there <laughs> your head, as you're going around i can't help just uh, yeah. like visualizing that and then i'm trying to pay attention but all i can see is your head going <laughs> as it's getting hit I'm, I'm actually loving this, and I think I'm loving it so much because I was so ready to be disappointed. Okay, great. Or just not, like, just go, yeah, it's them releasing more music. Cool. But I'm like, they're releasing more music? Cool. Rings in the background, yeah, yeah. I love, I love that placement yeah, of those. It's super fucking catchy. Yeah. Um, also loving that little backing guitar riff. I like this guitar that's about to kick in right now. This line is sick. I do too. <clears throat> Press play. After, After you, you, sir. You paused. True. The strings? So good. That solo, I hate to take it back to the Metallica thing yes, I said, fully. but it's it such was a Kirk Hammett feel. Fully. Such the, 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 the wow, 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 wow. Wow. Yeah, big riffs, yeah. Oh, if this is if this is where we're going next, asking Alexandria, your boy's back in. I mean, not that you care, you got fucking heaps of fans, but... Your boy, though. <laughs> take me home, I think I'm Ooh. ready to be on my own. That was a good time for all involved. 
Yeah, that... Except for the little Johnnies. Yeah, I was actually about to say that. They've got a headache. Um, oh, see what's on the inside. Coming October 1. That's got me... That's got me super excited. Look, I'm not one for really complaining when a band changes to a direction that I don't enjoy. Because... It's not my fucking place to sit here and whinge about artists wanting to take a different direction or take other things. So keep that in mind next time you do that. And we've seen it massively with bands like Parkway Drive, Metallica. As soon as the sound changes a bit, these guys copped it, Bring Me the Horizon copped it. Copped so much shit from keyboard warriors trying to tell artists how they should express themselves and how they should do what they do. I don't think that's necessarily a change of sound. As I said, no, you that's- listen to... That's probably going back to the more sort of metal influence, but it's it's a different spin on it. Yes. Yeah, it's gone for, as you said, those like more Metallica style influence stuff. Even like that solo had like a, even like a little bit of like an Avenged Sevenfold feel to it. Yep. Um, yep. Well, it's got the, the song has that space and it's that tempo to really come across in a stadium setting. Yeah, and it was that big drive. Yeah. The solo was plenty flashy, um, you know, gave it a bit of speed, uh, even that second half of the verse riff. But that's the other thing as well, like ban- bands like this and, you know, well, especially bands like Parkway, when they went from being such a fast, heavy metal sort of band, when they're playing big stadiums and people want to sing along, you do kind of have to cater to that as well because I'm these sure. sounds come across so much better being at a specific tempo uh, in an outdoor venue, and that's essentially what they play now. But, yeah, like like I was saying, I'm not going to go off at bands for changing their style. I'll just sort of go, eh, I'll just listen to the stuff I like. Yeah, That's excited me. That's excited me a lot. Yeah, I love that. I loved all of that. I think it was so well written. I think it had all the things, all the boxes that you ticked. You're yeah. right. But it I'm also idiot, just... I'm an idiot, I'm an idiot. Yeah, you're absolutely right. <laughs> um, but I, yeah, it was fantastic. What did you guys think? Uh, are you like me? You've listened to the band in the past and you're excited for the future? Or is this your first time hearing them? And like Johnny, you're excited for this type of sound. Yeah, um, definitely excited. Again, he, let's just quickly touch on his voice. What a strong Boop. voice. It's phenomenal. Perfect. Yeah, he has such so crazy powerful. control mm. of that like slightly rough but well refined sound I'm glad you said that as well because it just it reminded me of that chorus just before it went in it was really Mm -hmm. sort of breathy and like stop that fuck I hate that oh hey thanks so much we'll see you guys next time I think it's time that I take some time to